to the Now Cincinnati. Hope you're having a great Christmas Eve so far. And while the countdown to Christmas continues, the deadline for one iconic part of the holiday has passed. The Salvation Army wrapped up its annual Christmas kettle campaign earlier today. And the Now's Brianna Harper joins us live at the Salvation Army to explain why this year's results aren't quite as jolly as in years past. Brianna? Tis the season for giving, and the money collected by the Salvation Army's Red Kettle, unfortunately, is just short of a Christmas miracle. Amid the hustle and bustle of last minute holiday shopping, you'll hear a familiar sound. And you'll see a familiar sight. For more than 100 years, the Salvation Army's Christmas Kettle Campaign gathers donations now to help give back later. But this year, the donations are down. So much so that the charity is nearly $200,000 short of its goal. I think everybody can afford a buck, you know, anything you can do just to help out. Brad Coleman has been a bell ringer for the past seven years. He says he's proof of just how much the Red Kettles give back to him and so many others in need. People thank me for being out here and sometimes they buy you coffee and stuff, so it's nice. I'll let my way to give them back. The Salvation Army will now have to consider other funding options to help close the gap and still be able to afford as many community services. Yet still, the more than $600,000 collected this holiday season won't go unnoticed. I'm so blessed to have everything that I have, and um, why not pass it on if you can? Um, they obviously need it more than I do. Now, the Kettle Campaign has been ongoing since the 1890s, and organizers here at the Salvation Army say as long as the giving continues, so will the tradition. Reporting live, Brianna Harper, The Now, Cincinnati.